All right, guys, I am still out here at Terrytown RV Supercenter in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Last video, you saw these two RVs. Now let's take a look at these two. These are two more Rockwood Geo Pro travel trailers. These are a little bit larger. Both of these have some really interesting hues to their interior. And let's take a look at those now. Okay, first we're going to take a look at this G19BH. This is cool because it's a bunkhouse. Not only that, you're still getting all that really nice aggressiveness that you get from the outside of the Geo Pro. Nice aggressive tires, good ground clearance. You get the scissor jacks on all four corners, plus you have a refrigerator freezer, which this is the back of right here. That's the vent hood you want to make sure to open up anytime you go out camping. Outdoor speakers. You have a ladder that takes you to the very top. This one is also wired with solar. Let's take a look at the inside. One thing to keep in mind, you also get the Torflex suspension with any of these, which means it's an independent style suspension. It uses rubber bushings and it gives you the ability to really take these in a lot of environments that other RVs may not be able to traverse as well, simply because you have that really nice independent setup. With a single axle, this works out really good because you don't have to worry about equalization of double axles. So single axle, Torflex, great setup. Coming inside of this G19BH, you can see what I'm talking about. No slides, has a nice compact look and feel to it. You get two bunk beds, nice dinette, which also turns into a bed. Plus, you get a really nice queen size bed up front and a lot of windows. This one has a front facing window as well, which is going to bring a lot of light in here. And for me, I like the extra security that that front window affords you. Entertainment center for your TV plus your entertainment up here, so you can connect to it with Bluetooth, USB. Really nice little compact kitchen, three burner cooktop, stainless steel sink, cabinetry everywhere, storage everywhere. Again, this is something that is kind of synonymous with this brand. They try to give you storage everywhere, plus the lighter tones. I love the fact that they're using lighter tones, lighter flooring, lighter cabinets. Everything is really nice about this unit. You have two bunks here. You have a ladder to get up to your top bunk, which is really nice. And a full-size bathroom. So this is really nice. You're going to have a nice shower in here, plus more storage, fantastic fan, as well as a really nice foot flush toilet. Again, just a lot of room. And you have a nice mirror here as well. Now, this is a relatively compact bathroom, so don't expect a sink to be in there. You're going to have to come out and use this sink to wash your hands. But you even have more storage underneath the bunkhouse, which is really nice. Plus a ton of cabinets and drawers in here. I absolutely love the interior of these travel trailers. Very well laid out, a lot of windows, a lot of lighting, and even more storage. Let's take a look at the outside of this one. So I wanted to let you see what the Torflex suspension looks like underneath here. You can see that it rides on kind of a pivot arm here. And inside of the axle tube is actually four rubber bushings that surround a metal rod. And those act as the suspension or as the spring. Has an interesting frame design. So this is a C-channel frame design versus your traditional I-beam frame. But very nice setup. LED lights. All of these are going to have LED lights on the back. It's also wired for the Furion backup camera and it has a really cool door here which gives you access into the bunk room. So if you're going to be using this space for storage, this would be an excellent location. You know, if you're looking for a camper that would even be ideal for someone who is single by themselves wanting to go out, having the storage they need to maybe put their bicycle, things like that, this would be an excellent travel trailer to look at. Coming around here to the connection side, you can see you have your 30 amp connection, cable satellite, outside shower, plus your water connection and your tank fill. This is gonna be your hot water heater and huge pass-through storage. Let me turn some light on so you can see how big this is. For such a small compact travel trailer to have this much pass-through storage is pretty impressive. You also have your boondocking lights, which is really nice. Light up here on the front. Again, you're going to get your dual propane tank, dual battery box, power tongue jack. Very nice look to this unit. 
So let's take a look at the numbers on this unit. This one has a 3,860 pound gross vehicle weight rating, but only a 668 pound cargo capacity, which means that they've derated this unit or they've essentially lowered the cargo capacity to keep this thing in a lower weight class. That being said, can you carry more weight than that? Likely. In terms of a tow vehicle, this is still easily half-ton towable, and it's a good size travel trailer. So this is going to give you a lot of flexibility in terms of bringing your family with you. Really nice bunkhouse in the back, nice queen-size bed up front. It's going to give you a good full-size bathroom, which is really nice, plus a nice size kitchen. This is definitely something that I could see a small family with a half-ton truck or even a large SUV owning. So finally, we're going to take a look at one more of these Rockwood Geo Pro travel trailers. So this specific one is model number G19QB, and it is a front bed unit. This is a very cool design. Again, this one has a very nice interior, plus it has a slide out. So that's going to be really nice for a lot of people. It has a nice curved ceiling to it, plus a queen size bed at the front. You can sleep two people there, two people on this little booth dinette area has a nice size kitchen with a lot of space, especially back behind this area. Plus you're gonna have your microwave, refrigerator, tons of cabinetry, TV up here, tons of storage, again, synonymous with the Rockwood brand. Even more storage above the dinette area. In the back bathroom area, this is really nice because they actually give you a good amount of room. Not only do you have a huge vanity here with a lot of storage and a nice medicine cabinet, you're going to have your toilet as well as more storage for toiletries and a shower system here, which is really nice. So instead of having that traditional compact tub, this one's going to give you a shower stall, which is just a very nice convenient space for it. And I think more useful than the tub. Again, as with all of these, very nice color interior, very light tones, nice and airy, has a good fresh feeling to it. I love the fact that they have the front window plus these two side windows next to the bed. It gives you a tremendous amount of lighting and it just gives you that open airiness feel, especially if you're in a park or a campground or a national park, state park, where you want to be able to kind of view what's around you. Could you imagine waking up and just seeing the mountains and the water and everything else right outside your windows? I love how they laid this out. And something that's nice about all of these Rockwood GeoPros is that they utilize Asdell for the outside skin. So Asdell, again, will not delaminate, it will not rot, it will not hold water. It is essentially that next generation material that most RVs should use to protect the skin simply because you don't have any chance of water getting between the fiberglass and the wood that most RVs are made out of and causing a delamination issue. With a unit like this, you're never going to have to worry about that. So this specific unit that we're looking at also has an awning which runs almost the full length. It doesn't complete the very front area, but it has a cool gutter system right there to drain water off the top. Also uses the stabilizer jacks on each side, and it has an outside connection, outside speakers, if you want to bring a TV or something else like that out here. Plus, this one has also a very nice large pass-through storage up front. Coming around to the other side, you can see this one still has that accent light up front. They call it a boondocking light. Double propane canisters, two battery holders, power tongue jack with the jacket, bike rack up front, which is also very nice. Taking a look at the numbers on this unit, this has a 3,913 pound gross vehicle weight rating, 673 pound cargo capacity. Other side of your pass-through storage, back side of your water heater, tank fill, city water connection, Here's your single slide. On the back side of here, you're gonna get even more storage, which is really nice. Same aggressive tires, 30 amp connection, cable satellite. On the back, you're gonna have your shower plus your LED lights, and it is pre-wired for a Furion wireless backup camera. And something else that's really nice about this unit, it has a roof rack on it. So if you're going to bring a kayak or skis or anything like that, it gives you a place on top to be able to store them while you're traveling. So that's also really nice. You can see your TV antenna as well as your Wi-Fi booster and your single AC unit up top. And just like all of these Rockwood GeoPros, it already has solar power mounted on top of it. I don't know if you can see it. 
These are just super cool, compact, lightweight travel trailers. Again, half-ton towable, large SUV towable that give you the ability of having a really nice, comfortable, modern, airy interior, lots of amenities, great build quality at a price point that isn't even going to come close to what some of these higher-end units like an Airstream are going to cost. These are really ideal for a lot of people. And I think a lot of people may not look at these because they feel that at the price point these go for, they can get something larger. And in many cases, you're getting something larger that might not be built as well that you're towing behind a truck that is just too light to tow it. So with something like this, you're getting pretty much all the categories you want checked. Quality, lightweight, features, amenities, modern interior, resale value, solar power, things like that in a package that's easily half-ton towable, but might cost slightly more than some larger, lesser equipped travel trailers that will probably put more stress on your tow vehicle. Anyways, guys, I want to give a big shout out to the folks at Terrytown RV Supercenter here in Grand Rapids, Michigan. I will put the information to this dealership in the description of this video, just in case you want to learn more information about these trailers, you want to look at pricing, things like that. Keep in mind, MSRP on all of these is not the price you're going to pay. Most of the time, these units are going to be marked down anywhere between 25 and 33%, or even more in some cases. So you really just have to look at the specific model that interests you and find out what is the best deal that they're willing to to offer you. What I love about this specific dealership is the fact that they have their own delivery service. Whereas most companies are going to contract out to a hotshot company to bring it to you and that drives the cost up significantly. But at Terrytown, they actually have the ability to deliver any of these RVs anywhere in the country using a delivery service that they own, which makes it a little bit more convenient and less expensive for you, the buyer. So guys, if you haven't had a chance, please take a moment, subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up. We'll talk to you again really soon. Actually, I think I want to film that one next.